I'm the Crimson Tie. If you're not familiar, I'm a maxed one defense spear with the goal of completing all content possible within that restriction. That means completing every quest, achievement diary, combat task, collection log slot, everything. I'm currently at 19 pets. I have 52 prayer, 1 defense, 60 attack, and 99 everything else. I am the 1 defense completionist here. Welcome to my journey. Welcome back to another episode of the One Defense Completionist Pure. In the last episode, we took on the holiday event, the birthday event for 10, 11? Was it 11 years? Yes, 11 years of old school RuneScape. Uh, wow, I should have dressed up in some of the holiday stuff. Uh, I guess you'll just have to watch that episode to check that out. Uh, thumbnail in the description, uh, or uh, flip, flip to the thumbnail right now maybe i don't know anyway check out that episode and uh we were also with the help of our good friend uh blooming onyx uh able to determine that we needed to do the kq uh task for the achievement diaries because in the desert elites there's actually a task speak to the kq head in your player owned house and uh we weren't able to do this until just recently when uh the when Jagex gave us the ability to uh, mount uh, heads without getting uh, defense XP. So that was really cool. And uh, the super fan here. Oh yeah, super fan. We got a super fan. So we are going to get into the singles plus versions of these bosses. This is uh, mostly all of the uh, singles plus uh, bosses are mostly around this area, I think. Hunter's End. Uh, Skeletal Tomb. And where's the other one? Uh, Web Chasm. I think those are all the singles plus uh, caves. So anyway, uh, I'll go ahead and unlock the uh, peak options in each one of them. And then uh, we'll go ahead and grind out the 101 KC for each of them for the high scores. Here's what my inventory looks like. Oh, hey, Chinpei. Hey, what's up, buddy? Uh, here's what my inventory looks like right now. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, I'm not really risking anything. I'm uh, three iteming. Oh, this is some real fucking toxic shit. Like, look at this fuck. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. Look at this fucking little rat. Fucking scout bots. <laughs> this is kind of funny. What loot am I going to get? Oh, huh. not bad. Take that. This is a uh, pretty fucking chill, I gotta say. I might like, uh, you know, unlock the uh, peak option at least for every boss. Because if you kill the boss twenty times, you can peek into the cave, which will save you a lot of time and misery getting attacked by the boss while other people are fighting it. Oh, uh, just got a long bone from the uh, <laughs> Callisto. Lol. So I can basically AFK this boss with the F bow, and uh, it's basically like two, three, three prayer pots and inventory of anglers is like uh, two kills basically. Eight. Okay, time to go. And there's twenty kills, giving us the ability to peek into the room. Listen, unless it's a stale baguette, I don't really care right now. A kebab now. So some guy just tried to crash me, and I just, uh, I let him have the rest of the kill. He killed the last, like, one-third of it, and I got Onyx Bolt tips, so, uh, I said thank you. I think he's triggered a little bit. Alright, there's 20 kills. We've unlocked the ability to, uh, peek into this room now, so now we can PK here. Um, we're gonna go do that for the last boss. The skeleton. Skelly boy. We're gonna go do that for the skelly boy. Oh, there's the uh, first kill here. That wasn't too bad. Actually, that was pretty easy. I have supplies enough to uh, do another kill, probably. Uh, holy shit. 370k drop of Raynars. Uh, what the fuck? Holy fuck. Okay, 
I cheated, but all right, here we go. Last part of this cryptic clue. Please don't fuck me, please. <gasps> oh, wow. The fucking master casket. This could be the bloodhound right here. Let's go ahead and open it. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. That's master casket number seven. Damn. What a bunch of shit. And that is 20 kills. So now we can peek into every boss room, and that will make PKing a lot easier in the future. So yeah, fuck yeah, a new unlock. Peeking in every room. Oh yeah. <laughs> Fucking kind of a weird... Uh... <laughs> That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Hell yeah. Woo! <laughs> bank. Bank. Nice, I got him. Fuck yeah. Two hundred and seventy-four K. get wrecked I don't know not bad. oh yeah not bad <laughs> all right so I decided to go ahead and buy uh, uh, invest in the uh, staff uh, wilderness staff and the skull because I think they might go up after this next update yeah, uh, freeze is pretty easy actually, so it's actually oh oh fuck. What I say that in a matter of runes, oh boy. <laughs> that was a close kill. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, so face taking the boss, I'm getting about two kit Really phone? Really phone? Uh, getting about two kills easily, uh, just face taking the boss like this. You definitely need prayer. I mean, there's no way you can't do this without prayer, but yeah. About two, maybe three kills sometimes. I think I have gotten a couple trips that were uh, three kills. Whoa, hey, that's not too bad at all. Holy crap. Wow, that's a pretty good drop, actually. Cool. Wow, this is so crowded. There's uh, so many crashers. It's... Yeah. This is a very easy boss, but man, there is just no honor here. Uh, there is uh, so many PKers and so many people that just uh, will try and steal your world. And uh, yeah, so I get asked this question a lot. That I got asked it in the last video, and somebody responded. But you just saw like I'm hitting like high thirties on uh, the like uh, bosses, you know. Uh, with the uh, F-Bow, Bofa, F-Bow, whatever you want to call it, and the Necklace of Anguish, and the Ranger's Tunic. That's all I'm wearing, and I'm hitting, like, <clears throat> pretty, pretty high 30s. So, I'm just wondering, what are you guys talking about exactly when you say it's not worth it? Because this bow slaps, and I'm not risking anything right now. Look at that, 37, that's exactly, 34, that's what I'm saying, guys. Like, what are we talking about with this, this is, this bow is totally worth it. This guy's gonna try and PK me, huh? Oh, no, he's not. Well, um, I think I got four kills this round. That was a really good round. Oh, that was awesome. I just easily got away from this PK here. Like, what a dumbass. What a fucking awful kid. 75 attack. You're fucking terrible, bro. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, hey, I have a telly block on me. Hold on. Switch them world.
<laughs> oh my god ha ha I'm triggered ah ha, ha I'm triggered oh man I'm fucking triggered well I think I'll just tell you out of here since I won that fight bitch yeah I'm triggered that's that's why I'm in my house healing up and gonna go check my loot key while you're uh you're dead how do i check a loot key here is there a is there a chest out here oh wait here it is here it is loot chest okay 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 yeah that's why i'm here looking at your loot the fuck is this bullshit oh and he went through the rev ca you fucking moron ah i got your rev money you stupid idiot ah i love it okay bake that shit this guy again <laughs> I guess I get his key money now, huh? <laughs> what a fucking moron. Why did he do that? I totally got his key. No, I didn't. Hey, where's his key money? He went in here. I should have got his key money. Wow, what a moron. I think you're triggered, buddy. I think... Oh, another one. Oh, I thought it was going to be another one. That would have been awesome. The only thing that's kind of annoying about that is that I'm poison now so would you give me mr. 75 oh you fucking idiot thank you I just randomly getting a kill and my clan mate came in here and I was like yo what's up man like what are you up to and I was like are you with this guy and he was like no okay the more times I do this the more kills I get I'm all right welcome back to another episode wait I already did the intro uh okay so <laughs> Today, uh, we are joined with a uh, uh, friend of the channel, uh, Blooming Onyx, and he is going to help us with the spindle boss, because I uh, would love to not have to deal with the spiders while I kill it, and pretty good. Oh yeah, we made money. Yeah, so I knew that the multi-version of uh, the spider... Um, I knew that you could attack the spiders together. I thought you could do it on the singles version, the singles plus version as well. I mean, magic, 60k worth of magic logs, that's not bad. Got that fucking kill. For a room pickaxe! Okay, so, uh, Onyx made a good point. I should, uh, probably refresh everybody with what's going on. Venonatus and Spindle, here is the collection log. As you can see, I've got 940 Venonatus kills and 24 Spindle kills so far. We have the pet. We don't have the tyrannical ring. Uh, we have 13 dragon pickaxes, 15 dragon two hands. Uh, we don't have the fangs of Venonatus yet, or obviously the Void Waker gem, which we will get this video, probably, hopefully, right now. Was it worth it? Oh, holy shit. Hey, it might have been worth it. Uh, that's an elite clue scroll. Cool. All right. Best in slot fashion. Escape. Reachieved. I can't remember if I did a video about this, but basically you just avoid the bullshit. You kill the spiders when they come up to you. Uh, the green ball thing is a range attack. Every once in a while he'll switch to a magic attack. And he switches back and forth every like four to five attacks or something. Something along those lines. He'll probably switch. Yep, right now I just guessed. And, uh, you know, I just kind of go with my intuition. You know, I just don't know if I'm down with the refiltering, uh the reordering filters uh I, I just don't think i'm gonna figure out the muscle memory at this point like i've gotten so used to it at this point so i just don't know if that's gonna be feasible this drunken dwarf popped up the exact second i killed him the exact second i killed spindle that's really i, I thought i got the i thought i got the pet again but that wouldn't even make sense because my pet's in my house mm-hmm There's a uh, kill number uh, 50, and uh, ooh, uh, an elite clue scroll. I like that. Big fan of that. You need to be wielding a butterfly net. It just wants me to risk my account, huh? 
Okay, soul altar. We could do that. Island. I'm pretty sure we can do that. All right, let's see what we got here. Don't screw me. Oh. Yeah, unfortunately, for some reason, I can buy the rolling pin, but I can't equip it, which is just kind of. Oh. Man, it is just fucking so fucking stupid. I mean, it's actually kind of toxic if I'm being. Entering a realm of endless possibility, my son. Welcome to the Spindle Cave. Dun 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 Every world is full. Every world is full. That guy just got the crawling hand. We used to have that, but we got the Hydra head now. It's like the Halo guy. Perfect. I don't just had a PKer come after me, but he's too high level to attack me because I'm in a 2k total world. But uh, wow, big money! Ooh, big uh, diamond, uh, diamond drops right now. Ooh, barely got that one. Uh, diamonds are really popular today. Oh, hey. Oh, another kill. Mm-hmm. Hey, that's pretty good. Nice. Not bad at all. I guess one thing that is unfortunate about this grind is, is that since switching to 2k Total Worlds, I haven't had a lot of anti-PKs, uh, so that kind of messes up the content. Maybe for the Vedion grind, I'll uh, go ahead and switch back to normal worlds. All right, and I can't say I enjoyed the spindle grind quite as much as I did the other grind, but, uh... Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus Christ. Almost fucking died there. What the fuck? All right, and that is going to do it for the spindle grind. You know, it wasn't quite as enjoyable as the other grinds, but, uh, we had some fun. And, uh, that's one one kills for diamond bolts all right we're finally ready for the last boss uh which is betty on and uh here's my setup uh i hope it's gonna be good i can't remember what i used the other day but uh yep i got the salve e the gorgeous chain mace not gonna risk any ether because i'm lazy and Regen bracelet, tyrannical ring, we're risking basically nothing. Uh, I'm going to take my cape out of my inventory uh, once we, uh, well, next inventory, I guess. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, my first kill back. That wasn't too terrible. So, I've changed my gear up a little bit. The uh, Wikipedia said to stick with a berserker ring instead of a crush ring. Not sure if that's a good idea. I'm not going to risk a fire cape out here because I don't, re don't really feel like doing fight caves right now. Um, switch to the combat bracelet to the mithril gloves uh, just so I could keep the uh, blessed uh, dehyde traps. <laughs> that way I could, uh, you know, uh, have a little more, more defense here. And uh, so yeah, that's the three items I'm risking now. The fight is pretty straightforward. You get him down to half health, and uh, he will spawn these little dog guys. You kill the dog guys, because you can't damage him anymore after that. And then uh, 
yeah, then you can attack them again. Those are a lot more enjoyable than uh, these spindle ones. <laughs> Ancient staff. <laughs> oh, hey. Ooh, elite clue scroll. Oh no. Okay, it's time for master clue. All right, here we are at the church. Okay, I think I got him. All right, let's see to that clue. Okay. Well, this pier is trying to show me up with the inferno cape, but uh, you know, I'm just not gonna bite on the. Uh, you know, on the bait on that. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Ooh, only used one food for that uh, kill. I basically, whoa, shit, getting cocky. Uh, basically, I've gotten to the point where I don't even need food here. Jesus, I mean, look at this. Uh, I think I've used one food for each of these kills. Yeah, that's uh, one food for each of those kills. Wow. Ooh. Okay, lag X, you gotta stop with that shit. Okay. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Holy shit. Void Maker's Blade. Holy shit. Well, that's the fucking video right there. <laughs> well, what are you gonna. I mean, what are you gonna say? I'm just gonna fucking drink my coffee here. How much is that? God damn it. That's fucking savage. It's fucking savage, y'all. Well, let me see. Let me sell the actual thing that has uh, 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 in, in inherent value right here. All right, check it out. The collection log, the Void Waker Blade. Oh my! Came out with a clean twenty-six mil. Not very impressive. Oh yeah. Hey, I got a lamp. Uh, I could save that for the new skill item. <laughs> how long? Uh, how long is that zag gonna take? <laughs> That's uh, kill number seventy. Watch me punk out this guy. You gotta love it. It's uh, kill number eighty right there. This might be uh, one of my longest trips ever. Look how much loot I've got. I think that's probably going to be the last one for this trip. And that is how you punk out some noobs. Again. Oh my god. The best upgrade could be right here in front of me. Square sandwich. Uh, okay, yeah, that's not a bad get. That doesn't do anything for me. I like it. Smiley face. Alright, that's kill number 90, I think. Yeah, kill number 90. Ooh, hey, Samfuse. Damn, burn. Get the fuck out of my... This is my house. Uh-oh, uh, 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 I pissed this guy off. That's uh, kill number 100 right there. Ooh, hey. Uh, we can do our last 101 kill uh, with those super restores. I appreciate that. Alright, there it is. The last uh, kill. 101 kills. Not bad. We did that for the high scores, if you didn't remember. Uh, but here's the Void Waker Blade, uh, the 101 kills of, uh, Cavalarian, or however you say that. 
Uh, spindle, 101 kills. Uh, did not get any uniques from him. Our RTO, here's 101 kills from him. So that's the 101 kills. Hell yeah. Hope to see those in the high scores soon, as promised. And that is going to do it for another episode of the One Defense Completionist Pure. I hope you enjoyed it. We got the Void Waker Blade. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty tickled by that. And uh, the next video is actually going to be a mystery grind. Uh, I have a couple of uh, housekeeping things I want to do on the account. And uh, it's going to be a mystery. A uh, bunch of mis uh, miscellaneous things, uh, honestly, is what the uh, video is going to be. But it's going to be uh, a, a, a very interesting... Uh, menagerie of uh just random things uh random uh random stuff we gotta do so yeah let's uh fucking uh yeah we're gonna party down and uh get that shit going so uh i hope you join me for that video and uh yeah take care uh see you in the next one have a great uh great day a great life and uh i hope everything uh works out in the long run for you uh you know it's a wild fucking uh a wild fucking ride man take care now bye bye